Boys, today I'm going to be making a video on the glitched range add-ons for Nurse in DBD. So basically, range add-ons are only meant to extend the distance at which you blink, and as a result, your charge time is meant to increase and your travel time is meant to increase. Well, for whatever reason right now in Dead by Daylight, your travel time does not increase for the extra distance that you're traveling. Without any more delay, let's get straight into these games. Okay, so we're on the Dead Dog Saloon, and already, if you haven't seen, you should have seen right there. She's in the bush, isn't she? I am so bad. You should have seen that. The travel speed of this blink is so much quicker already, and the whole premise of this video is basically just to work our way up from green range, which is a little bit faster, to purple range, to all the way to double range. Because your travel speed just gets quicker and quicker as you stack them up. Oh, I see someone. It's Fang. Okay. We'll take it. I almost messed that up, actually, because I had no line of sight. Uh, we should be able to get that. Nice. Yeah, so basically, this travel speed just is absolutely insane. It helps you out on chase at just a ridiculous amount. Because the time the survivor has to react against the nurse is already pretty low. And this just makes it even less amount of time that they have to react. They just have no time before you're just at them straight away and on their back. Ooh, almost. Nice dead hard, actually. Don't know if I would have hit, but... Wasn't bad. Claudette's just on a tree, okay. Because we're on such a small map with this build and range, we're just absolutely going to thrive in every way. I assume she's slow bolts. Is that even a vault? It's not. Either way, we got a nice down. And she DCs. Can I blame her? Not really. This seems really, really insanely strong. Oh, nice moonwalk. But I think this game is pretty much over anyway. Already? Oh, Wow, okay. Nice auto aim. There we go. The Claudette's right here. Perfect. I mean, unless Barbecue Chili is lying to me. This is the last survivor. I think we get her before she gets any unhooks. I'm not too sure, but then we can get into testing and showcasing the purple range, which gives you an even faster blink, and then a double range, which gives you the effects of both the purple and the green all at once. I mean, you tried Felix, unless you have DS, do you? Okay, fair enough, well played then. I was gonna say, it's not the best idea to force you into a grab, but I mean, I'll take it. Good hiding spot. <laughs> Okay, so we're on the Father Campbell's Chapel, and uh, yeah, this is where it gets- Okay, I'm terrible. This is where it gets a little bit ridiculous. As in, if you thought it was bad before, it's about to get so much worse. <laughs> like, this is completely insane. And I think we actually should be able to just get up and into main before they can even react, and yep, this is where this build just thrives because they have no reaction time whatsoever. And again, I don't know why they're getting back on main, but if they haven't seen what happened before, they're about to find out. Here they are. Perfect, okay. Now what's the plan? Oh, Floods of Rage, perfect. Literally perfect timing. That's why I absolutely love this perk on Nurse. It's like, especially paired with Starstruck and Aji, you're just gonna get a Scourge Hook every single time, and it just gives you free hits or downs every single time Floods of Rage actually activates. And if you're downing quick enough, then you just have a Starstruck down, <laughs> a free hit, anything. It just gives you so much more to work with. Should be able just to go for this buster straight away. I don't think they're Starstruck or anything, but... Oh, my blink was bad. There we go. You're just walking. Which I think this survivor does a lot because they almost lost me before. That whiffs again. Again? Okay. Survivor's like very tricky in the sense that they have just weird pathing. And... They walk a lot, I think. They just, like, try to actively give the kill with the slip. Should be a down here, though. They clearly know what they're doing. I'll give them that. These guys are absolutely pounding out. Well, there you go. Absolutely pounding out, gens. I think they just ran over that way. There was somebody coming for save. Yeah, if I catch this down, there's nobody else here as far as I'm aware. So they're in a pretty difficult position. They're playing pretty efficiently. Like, they're doing gens very quickly. And that's Floods of Rage again, just telling me exactly that the survivor's right here. Oh, they actually reacted in time that time. 
Fair enough. I suppose when the other two have just saved off Hook, it's not hard to guess that the nurse is probably coming for you when she's charging her blink. Blink to here. I don't really know where this guy's gone, though. Did he double back? No, he didn't. Scratch marks just kind of stopped existing on the corner for some reason. So I am well helped out that ace a lot. He's healed already, though. That's surprising. Okay. Didn't get the pallet in down, though. Didn't get the pallet down in time. I don't know what I just said. And he must have went to the left because I don't see him. LW. I guess that's because he has DH. Makes sense. Now what? We'll blink to here. He just loves holding W, okay? There's never ever a double back. When we go for this blink here. And perfect. Well, they're going for save already. I assume this person isn't starstruck then because... I mean, why would you be going for save if you're insta down? They were starstruck. Okay. Fair enough, I guess. Is that ace right here? Oh, it is. Okay. Oh, there's two aces. I didn't even realize. Okay, so the guy didn't heal up instantly. Oh, if I didn't charge my blink. That's so sad. Nice. What's the plan now, ace? Are we vaulting the window? We're not. Okay. This guy is Iron Wills. It's really hard to track him when he just quite literally holds W through this building. We can just leave him because over here they're going to be healing under the hook and we can just get three. Okay. I was about to say free tags. Other ace is all the way at Shaq. He has... Oh, I was about to say he has dead hard, but he didn't dead hard. Maybe that's the travel speed coming into play. Or maybe he just didn't react in time. I have no idea. And... I mean, I guess he thought he had nothing to work with. Sure. And Yui, I think, has given up on all hope on picking this guy up. So... We just hook and kill, I think. I assume this guy's on death hook. He's not on death hook, okay. So Yui was over here last time I saw them. Oh, is that them? Oh, that's unfortunate timing. The guy let go on hook right as Yui appeared. Yeah, I was gonna say wild guess. She definitely has sprint burst. She always has that ready to go. Like, literally. Are you serious? That put me down, okay. And she did get hatch. Okay, GG's. Now we're gonna go on to the double range, double speed. And for the last game, where it just goes completely insane, we're on the Temple of Purgation. If you didn't see that, well, I, I don't know how you miss it, to be honest, but yeah, it's quite ridiculous. And yeah, that never would have connected in a million years, but I don't blame this thing for uh, panicking with how fast I'm coming towards her. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty insane. Paired with both Bloods of Rage and Starstruck and Aji. Yeah, we should be we should be doing pretty well. Okay, somebody just saved over here. We should be able to land pretty much on this person's forehead or not far off it. Oh, I don't know if that should have hit, but I'll take it. Done a gen already, to be fair to them. Fair enough. Well played. Done two gens already. Okay. Well, they're not slacking. Oh, hello, Steve. Sorry that you have absolutely no time to react at all. No dead hard. Okay, sure. Perfect. I've just seen Fang. We have a score choke right here. Fang. Oh, she actually made some decent distance, but still. Not going to be great for her. I'm not going to second blink this just because I have a feeling that I don't catch that. We'll blink onto the corner of Shaq, though. Oh, she did dead hard that. Okay. She seems to just panic dead hard every time. Here she is, finally, okay. And Floods of Rage is just telling me that they're healing under the hook. Well, they're gonna get a surprise when my Starstruck activates now. I assume they've left, surely. Oh, they're actually sticking it, that's so sad. <laughs> Steve went for the flashlight save. Well, he didn't leave the rocks because there are no scratch marks going across. There he is, you gonna drop this pallet? Thank you, buddy. Oh, and the last survivor's right here. Okay. <laughs> well, I had no plans of going for her at all, but she just ran into me. And I was like, huh? Chase music started? She has life. Okay. I can only assume she is BT, right? I'll wait for my blinks back. I'll just go for Claudette. There we go. And then I should be able to just come up here and see off the Yui. She might be able to pick up Steve. Nice. GG. Yeah, these add-ons are, are just disgusting. <laughs> like, they were already some of the best add-ons in the entire game, and now they've just made them ten times worse. Yes, okay. She went for save, okay. She's back on the floor, okay. Steve wouldn't have DS, would he? 
Well, I tried. <gasps> that was all intended in every way, shape, and form. <laughs> and I think it's only fair to give this last survivor hatch after all that. <laughs>